jednak większą relikcją będzie korona i prawa No i właśnie to korona. What's up guys? Today is our first full day in Budapest and we're starting it by going to the Zetchenye Spa. It's basically this big network of pools and we were there in 2016, had a great time. The weather's great today so we're gonna head over there now. So we will film as much as we can. So we've made it to the front entrance at the Sechenyi bathhouse. Let's go inside. We've made it to the spa. Place is ready to go in the pool. How was it? How was the special water? It was quite lovely. Was it cold? Yeah, it was chilly. Although, uh, if I had a beer, it would have been better. As you all know, water and electronics, not a good mix. So, Alicia's already been in the pool. Now it's my turn to go in. But for that, I'm going to put this camera away. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Ah, that was nice and refreshing. Inside, they have all these different thermal pools, um, different, ranging in different temperatures. Some are hot, some are cold. They have a whole bunch of saunas and steam rooms. Um, so what we do is we go into a hot sauna, stay there for two to three minutes, and then jump in the freezing cold pool. Very refreshing. Anyways, now we're gonna head back to our hostel, uh, drop our towels off, get changed, and try to make our way over to the Basilica. There's a really cool relic there. We're changed and we're ready to head back up. Luckily, these stairs aren't as bad going down as they are going up. But we get a good workout in. So we're walking out front of St. Peter's Basilica. Last time we were here was about three years ago and I was just starting off vlogging. Didn't really have the days planned very well and there was something very special inside that we missed. And that special something was the hand of St. Stephen, otherwise known as the Holy Hand. So now that we've visited the Basilica and seen what we wanted to see, we're gonna slowly walk back to our accommodations and head out for dinner. So as we were heading back to our hostel, I remembered that Yarmir Yager has a brewery out here. So we're in search of Yarmir 68. So we just finished having our beer. Highly recommend it. I'm not joking, that was probably my favorite beer. Alicia, tell them how good it was. It was great. It was very good. It was a lager. 
did not have a lingering bitter taste. It was quite crisp, very refreshing. No, because you had three. I did have three. Very, I couldn't say no. That's over a liter. He, it's 1.3, 1. 1.5 oh, liters. Okay. He would be like, do you want another one? So I had to say yes. Um, very crisp, very refreshing like a Pilsner. Very good. So now it's almost six o'clock, so time for dinner. So we are here at our favorite restaurant from when we were here in 2016. It's called Frissy Papa. It's actually right across the street from our accommodation, but when we spoke with a local, this is one of their recommendations. The prices are very good, very favorable. Uh, for example, Alicia is getting a vegetarian dish. It's a mushroom goulash. It's only about $4 Canadian for her dish. Let's dig in. So this is the chicken paprika. It's a local dish. Excellent. Very, very tasty, very good flavor. I would recommend this dish. So we just finished our dinner. Uh, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please make sure to subscribe uh, with bell notifications. If you enjoyed this video, also please hit that like button. Your support definitely goes a long way. Tomorrow we plan to go to the Budapest Zoo. So thank you for watching. See you guys tomorrow. Okay, this vlog episode, this isn't over. Hungarian Rhapsody, we're here at Simpla Kurt, one of the best bars in the entire world. We were here in yesterday's vlog, so make sure you check that out. But now it's nighttime, let's have a couple of these. So I got a little bit of lighting, trying some of their craft brew, vanilla Hefeweizen. Not too bad. Not bad at all. Now next door to Simpla, there is like a food truck port here. A lot of different foods, uh, a lot of different food trucks. Great place. Good place to grab some food after you've had a couple drinks.